We got a chain right here for 79 cc. Take a look at this. You can't see what it is. That's a thumb throttle for something. And then let's look in this box. See if I can get it open. Huh. What could that be? Okay. Cover. Just don't ask, okay? Belt. Screws. Pulleys. Whatever. This is a setup that we have going on. I took the clutch off of here. Right, so now the installation for this guy. I got a little carried away. It's just on there. I'm gonna get it finished up and then we'll see if it improves anything. I'm in the shop right now. Pretty much, it's just a storage spot at this point. But I'm just looking around in the first video when we were filming the roads car going down the road the wheels on it Seems like that it's just gonna be too large because when it would hit asphalt it would be spinning on the ice just fine been perfect. So anyway, asphalt would stop and it, and it would stop. So I'm just looking around to see if there's anything like that. Come out here. There's Jace's lawnmower. He still needs to get that thing up and running. We'll have a video on that at some point but we have this wheelchair that we um bar road from the senior home down the road wheels on it look pretty much perfect so i think i'm gonna go take that out there and see if it works i'll film that too so editing Kate here just get a load of this guy see how long it takes him to get these tools ready is he a neanderthal is he dumber than a rock but i think so okay did he get his lefty loosey mix from his righty tidy or something man it is sad to see such low intellect life forms being on this planet right <laughs> bud gave up so my uncle pointed out to me that i'm being kind of dumber than a rock i can just take the back wheels and put them on the front then take the front wheels and put them on the back and it should work just fine. As a test, of course, still needed these wheels off though so that I can use this as a mount for that, so. Okay, so it seems like part two. Look at this kid. He has no idea what he's doing whatsoever. Out of anything he could have used, he used the poop wheelchair that was quote unquote borrowed from the senior home down the road. What a flicking gooby, bro. Okay, this is getting painful to watch. Let's skip to the end. Okay, we're gonna have to take a detour real quick because we got this thing started up so I need to move my car real quick so we can get this guy out. Just got her started back up. It's running all okay. We gotta move her real quick and then we can get him out of here.
got some beans, bro. Now I can get this guy out. It's not the best look, but this is what we got. So I got to buy new ones for the front to make it work. So this is what it looks like for now. You know, it looks dumb and squatted and, you know, but it's what we have. So let's try it out. I skipped ahead a little bit, just got this on there. It's not connected yet, because I figured I'd show you guys how to do this. Um, if you want a really good video, I have a link in the description. Rather Be Welding did a great job showing you how to not only do this, but also bypass a governor on these guys. I did not do that, and I probably won't do that for a minute, but what I'm just gonna do is hook it onto there, and I'll show you how to do that real quick. Change location at the neighbor's house. So that's fine. Um, way how you hook these up is take these guys right here. You gotta kink it. The way how I did it has to kink twice. Right now I'm trying to get it out on this side because then it will like kind of lock it in. It's gonna be kind of hard to see, but then just zip tie it somewhere. Change the locations again. We're back over here. Don't have to do this. Holy cow. But I just tucked it underneath and I wrapped it around. So that should be good. Also, I promised you guys in the thumbnail of the last video there was fire shooting out of the exhaust. Unfortunately, I don't have the funds to be able to get one of those exhausts. So again, hopefully this makes up for it. Hey guys, sorry that I couldn't get that thing running completely correctly. Hopefully this makes up for it. Oh! <laughs> 